How is DSAG supporting its member companies in building up and developing a workforce? With the offerings of the DSAG Academy, the DSAG support its members in two areas to shape their workforce of today and tomorrow. In our first field of activity, which we name Employ, the DSAG Academy pursues two goals. First, we want to, with research projects and webinars and expert interviews, shine a light on the requirements and wishes of the grown generations of employees. So we want to answer questions such as, how are they envisioning their workforce environment? What expectations are they having regarding their salary? Or what does an employer make really attractive for them? This content we publish in the forum of the DSAG Academy. And if you want to um, register for it, you can find that on the DSAG website. Further, all DSAG member companies can participate in our program, which is called DSAG Talents. This program enables to win over well-trained master students and um, our collaboration with the Steinweiss University of Applied Science helps us with this. So um, this collaboration enables us to mediate young um, master students young suitable master students into um, DSAG companies and there they work for 80% and get trained the other 20% on skills for a successful digital transformation but also on SAP skills. With our field of activity which we name Educate we do um, another two things. First, we support the existing employees and DSAG member companies to gain the necessary skill set to successfully once implement, but second, use as for HANA in their company. Um, to be able to do that, we recently signed a cooperation contract with SAP Education and Adoption. This allows us to convert needs identified by the DSAG community into customized seminars, which we can offer exclusively for DSAG members at a reasonable price. In addition to our SAP trainings, we want to make a contribution to the successful transformation of our DSAG companies. This is why we work on developing trainings, but also workshops to improve the digital skills of the employees, focusing on four areas which we name personal, team, technology, and business transformation. In this context, the DSAG Academy sees itself as a topic scout, but also as a curator of existing educational content. Together with carefully selected educational institutions, the DSAG Academy develops trainings that not only focus on teaching theoretically or methodologically skills, but also personal development companies and combine that with how are these skills being used in my daily business in the SAP ecosystem. What is the role of universities in the SAG Academy? When we take a, a look at our members, it becomes clear that not only companies, but also universities are DSAG members. So the DSAG as an organization functions as a mediator to communicate the needs of the universities to SAP and also support the realization of those new demands. A wonderful example on how the DSAG supports the universities is when our collaboration with the University Competence Center and um, why we try to enable universities access to diverse different cloud products for educational purposes. And the DSAG in particular wants to support the networking between universities and business companies by organizing conferences such as Business Meet Academia. The conference is a platform where universities and companies can exchange ideas on how to develop a sustainable cooperation between business and science within the SAP context. With this event, we also want to provide a concrete recommendation list and explain the most important steps universities, but also companies have to do to establish uh, successful partnerships. For the companies, this is really cool because um, they can gain access to new talents and they can also work on projects they might not have enough manpower for and gain fresh ideas from young talented students um, on like innovation problems they want to solve. For universities on the other side, uh, these partnerships with business companies can help 
to offer a practice oriented education for their students. What digital skills do you think students need to be ready for the job market? Personally, I think um, resilience and curiosity and empathy are um, three of the most important skills we all have to learn to be able to be successful. Also in a digitalized world, I mean, we know being uh, how hard it is being uh, all in the home office and still being able to connect with other people also via digital um, yeah, media we have to use for that. However, the two most important skill areas, I think, is first adaptability. So in the context of being open and willing to constantly question your skill set and also constantly improving your skill set. In other words, become a lifelong learner to stay relevant for the labor market. And um, the second one is courage, I think, because courage to try out new things and uh, don't be afraid of failing or as Elon Musk said, if you never fail, then you are not innovative enough.